Imagine this, it's 9 a.m., you're in your cozy home wearing your favorite PJs and taking a bite of that hot coffee dip pandesal while you face your laptop to do work. In the background, you hear tricycle noises, your neighbor's voices, and your lawless reminiscence that you've heard already so many times. It makes you wonder, what was the Philippines like then? And how much of the Philippines has changed today? Science and technology. Until the present, it continues to shape Philippine culture and identity in which it paved the way to apply Filipino customs in the digital world. Technology is not limited to gadgets as its scope also includes a wide variety of invention within the home settings. During the old times, Filipinos could only wash their clothes manually, cook food by first starting a fire from charcoal, lengthen fish lifespan by drying and so on. Due to the emergence of innovations, we now use washing machines, gas or electric stoves, and refrigerators that made Filipinos live with ease. You see, the advent of science and technology has brought such huge contrast between what Filipinos were before and what we are now. Without a doubt, science and technology have shaped our culture into what it is today. And obviously, our culture is entirely different from before. However, it is important to note that these innovations are mostly foreign. So what does this make of our identity? Who are the real Filipinos? The ones before or the ones now? Well, culture and identity are fickle things. And we must understand that these two ideas constantly change. Nick Joaquin's book on culture and history explained this very well where he elaborated that Filipino identity is what we have become. This includes all of the changes, all of the colonies, and all of the innovations that Filipinos have begun to use. All these things are what make us Filipinos, and therefore, Filipino culture encompasses what we are today. However, some may argue that science and technology is not nationalistic. We should go back to our roots, they may add. Well, nationalism is not as simple as doing what old Filipinos did. Rather, nationalism also includes embracing what we have become as Filipinos. Science and technology is not the enemy of nationalism. Instead, these two things can go hand in hand together that can support the Filipinos of the day. Science and technology have now become a part of our culture, and therefore, they are also part of the Filipino identity. 